In times of turmoil in the Middle East, Jews and Christians in Argentina held a ceremony to show the world that it's possible to live in peace. An Argentine cardinal who was almost elected pope celebrated Hanukkah in a Jewish temple in the presence of leaders of other religions. A family photo rarely seen. Rabbis, Catholic priests, and Afro Brazilian religious leaders standing side by side in a Jewish temple celebrating Hanukkah. Together they prayed for religious freedom and tolerance in the world, some chanting in Hebrew, others in silence, all asking for peace in their own words. Argentina is a cultural melting pot. Our religion, Umbanda, comes from Africa. But Africans and Jews have a lot in common. Our people were persecuted throughout history. The guest of honor of this interreligious ceremony was none other than Cardinal Jose Maria Bergoglio. The Archbishop of Buenos Aires was the second most voted candidate to succeed Pope John Paul II in 2005. And God said, let there be light. He spoke about the holy light shining on all mankind alike and lit a candle. December is a specially festive month in Buenos Aires as Argentina's Christians and Jews celebrate both Christmas and Hanukkah. It is common to see Christmas trees in giant menorahs in public squares and caravans of smaller menorahs on the capital's main avenues. No effort is spared when it comes to lightening up the skies. Let us light the candles for peace, pluralism, and peace among all people, no matter their religions, their beliefs, and their ideologies. It's still too early for Santa Claus to wander around the streets of Buenos Aires, where temperatures at this time of the year can reach 35 degrees centigrade. But in this square, Barney the friendly dinosaur hopped off a city tour bus for children and joined the festivities. This is very special, like uh, I think any of the 5,000 uh, places that we celebrate Hanukkah in public, even in Russia, even uh, in places like in Nepal, or in places that, uh, that uh, like you, you could think that uh, they would be ashamed to show that they are Jewish. But here, again, we are proud and uh, all the people are very happy. Argentina is known to be a melting pot of different cultures and religions. Nine out of every ten Argentines are Catholic, but the country also had a Muslim president, Carlos Menem, in the 90s. And it's the home of the largest Jewish community in Latin America. Monica Yanakiev for JN1 in Buenos Aires.